Uh, dear colleagues, uh, the next speaker is uh, Dimitrinka Vladeva. The topic of her talk is Catalan numbers and additively idempotent semirings. Dimitrinka, please. It is a presentation of my results published in five papers over the last 12 years relating the connections of additively idempotent semirings and Catalan numbers. Um, my uh, investigations in algebra uh, starts from this formula, a formula from Catalan numbers. Um, some history, uh, this uh, the sequence of Catalan numbers. Uh, the problem of finding the number of triangulation, triangulations of a convex n plus two uh, gone was first considered by Euler and a letter to Goldbach in 1751, where Euler con conjectured an answer equivalent, equivalent to the Catalan number formula. In 1838, after the first complete published proof by Lame, there are many papers by Kotelnikov, Fuss, Catalan and Binet. Richard Stanley is a professor from MIT, student of Giancarlo Rota, friend of Donald Knott. Uh, in uh, A, the first uh, of uh, these uh, books, uh, there is an exercise uh, with 66 parts. And each part defines a finite set of mathematical objects that is counted by the Catalan numbers. In the second uh, book, Stanley describes 214 objects counted by the Catalan numbers, along with an additional 68 in the problem sets. In uh, the next three books, uh, and uh, these two, I didn't find any connections of Catalan numbers and semirings. And algebra S with plus and multiply uh, with two binary operations is called a semiring if with plus it is commutative semigroup and uh, with multiply it is a semigroup. Uh, it is a valid distributive loads and uh, more information uh, can be found in uh, these two books of Boulan. Uh, Semiring S such that A plus A is equal to A for any A is called additively identified Semiring. There are important applications of additively identified Semirings, including optimization and control, differential equations, algebra, geometry, dynamic pr programming, mathematical physics and chemistry, mathematical biology, interval analysis, mathematical economics, game theory, computer technology, Petri nets, and cryptography. Boolean, Boolean algebras, fuzzy algebras, bounded distributive lattices, includes inclines, and other algebraic st structures are special case of additively idempotent semirings. Nilpotent endomorphisms and Catalan numbers. Uh, in uh, uh, this paper, the author studied the endomorphism semirings, semiring of a finite chain. Let us consider a finite set C n from uh, n objects, 1 to n minus 1, if we define x, v, i equal to max of x and y, where uh, there belongs to c, n, we obtain that uh, this uh, c, n with uh, v is a joint semi-lattice. The map alpha c, n to Cn is called an endomorphism of the finite chain Cn if 
alpha x v i is equal alpha x v alpha i. The set of all endomorphisms is an additi additively identical summary denoted by E uh, up uh, Cn with respect to the addition and multiplication defined by uh, this uh, uh, to equality, where x belongs to Cn and alpha and uh, beta belongs to E uh, Cn. This same ring is called an endomorphism, same ring of a finite chain. The set of endomorphisms with a fixed point zero is a sub ring of E C N and is denoted with uh, uh, the same uh, plus uh, up zero. The subset of this set consisting of the endomorphisms alpha with the property that alpha k is uh, less than or equal k is denoted by ket n. Using some combinatorial results, we obtain that ket is a semiring of order and Catalan number. Now we present the second my result of this paper. The set n uh, up n of the nilpotent elements, the endomorphism semiring has the following properties. N n consists of the endomorphisms alpha such that alpha k is uh, less than k for all k uh, belongs to uh, c n and not zero. N n is an ideal of the semiring ket n. The order of n n is the n minus one Catalan numbers number. New potent elements of subsemiric of the endomorphism semiring of a finite chain and Catalan numbers. In A, for a fixed K, we deal with the set of endomorphisms with a fixed point K, which is a subsemiring of ECN and is denoted by ECNK. The constant endomorphism kappa K belongs to ECN such that kappa k from m is equal k for any m is the multiplicatively absorbing element of e c n k. This implies the idea of studying endomorphisms similar to usual nilpotent elements. For constant endomorphism alpha k, the elements of n n k, uh, which is alpha from uh, E C N and alpha uh, to N K is equal to kappa K for some positive integer N K. Uh, it's called a K a new potent endomorphism. Uh, the following result holds for uh, for K belongs to C N, the set of K new potent endomorphisms N and uh, k is a subsemering of E C N of order uh, which is equal to <coughs> product of uh, k and n minus k minus one uh, to uh, Catalan numbers. As a consequence of the proof of the theorem, it follows that the semering n uh, and k as are disjoint for k belongs to one to n minus two the endomorphisms alpha such that alpha r is greater than and equal r for r uh, one to uh, k minus one and alpha k is equal to k and alpha s is a less than and uh, equal s for s equal to k plus one uh, to n uh, minus one. Uh, it's uh, 
K. Uh, it's uh, called near K nilpotent endomorphisms. The subset of ECN consisting of all near K nilpotent endomorphisms is denoted by NN uh, up K and uh, down N. Uh, this indices. The next results can be su summarized in the next of near K nilpotent endomorphisms has the following properties. Uh, WN and K is a subsummary of ECN of order C uh, K plus one multiplied to C N minus K. Uh, the summering and uh, and K is an ideal of N, uh, double N, and K. Roots of idempotent endomorphisms and Catalan numbers. Uh, in the first work, uh, the main result for idempotence of C ICN is the subset of ECN. Uh, of all idempotent endomorphisms with S fixed points, K1, K, uh, 2KS, uh, is a summary of order, the product of uh, distances from uh, KM plus, plus one minus KM, M from one to S minus one. In ring theory for non-commutative non rings, we have no information about similar results. Note that commutative ring is called idempotent if every ideal is generated by an idempotent. In uh, this work of Azami, uh, there is an interesting result. The ring Zn is an idempotent ring if and only if n is equal to p1 to uh, multiply to pm, where uh, all pk are distinct prime numbers. Now, let S be a finite semigroup. It is well known that for x belongs to uh, S, there is a positive integer k, such that a to k is idempotent. For any x and y, for S, we define this operation, uh, X uh, tilde Y, if and only if is, um, there exist K and M uh, belongs to N, uh, for which X to K is equal to Y to M and equal to E, where E as, is an idempotent element of S. Then we show that uh, this operation is an equivalence relation of S. To prove that equivalence classes module the, this relation of the semigroup ECN are semigroup, we need the following definition. Let alpha belongs to ECN. Element J belongs CN is called a jump point of A if j is not zero and one of these two conditions holds. Alpha from j minus one is less than and equal j minus one and alpha j is greater than j or alpha j minus one is less than j minus one and alpha j is uh, greater than or equal j. Then we can prove every endomorphism alpha belongs to ECN with just L fixed points, K1 to KL, which are not consecutive uh, for E1 uh, to L minus one has just L minus one jump point, jump points JI such that K I plus one is less than or equal J I, uh, which is uh, less and equal K I plus one. An endomorphism 
alpha with fixed point k1 1 k l ml and jump points g e k e from the previous definition is called an endomorphism of type uh, k1 to k1 my uh, m1 it is uh, um, fixed points j1 t1 is the first jump and uh, so on the jump points are defined by equality uh, j i t e is equal to k e m e plus t e and we denote uh, k e plus one one minus j e t e is equal to s e the last fact play a crucial role in the proof of the following combinatorial result every equivalence class module uh, of type one is a subsummering of ECN and uh, greater than or equal to of order this uh, formula uh, where uh, CP is the P pet Catalan number. Projection of subsummerings, which are derivations and Catalan numbers. In uh, uh, this uh, work, A, we study derivations, which are projection, projections of left and right ideal ideals of ECN for arbitrary A1 to A K minus one belongs to uh, CN. Uh, and uh, there is an um, increasing uh, uh, sequence. Uh, let A be uh, A0, A1 to AK minus 1. We consider endomorphisms alpha we, with image L alpha uh, included in A. The set of the all endomorphisms in a simplex sigma k n from a uh, the endomorphisms alpha are denoted but alpha and uh, a0 e uh, 0 a1 e1 a, a k minus 1 e k minus 1 in the, in inches uh, where uh, the sum of these indices are equal to n we construct a projection uh, G, uh, uh, M minus L, K minus one, this indices, uh, sigma N from A zero to A K minus one to sigma N, A L to A M, where zero is less than L, is less uh, m is uh, less or equal k minus one and a l l m are consecutive elements of the set uh, which we consider such that for any alpha uh, we can uh, write in this form uh, this uh, op operation now, then we construct the set D uh, M minus L K minus one, which is a subsummering of sigma N and prove the following result. result. If uh, L and M uh, belongs to this interval, the map D uh, uh, which um, D M minus one, K minus one, uh, go to uh, sigma N, uh, AL to AM is a derivation. The summering of this grade D is uh, the maximal subsummering of sigma N if the this map is a derivation. Uh, when L is equal to zero, uh, this derivation can be added and multiplied in the summering 
uh, G, which is the uh, an intersection from uh, zero to K minus one. And uh, just uh, considering D. If in addition, K is equal to N, it follows that uh, this intersection is uh, equal to ket n to O set. Therefore, the order of this summering is the end Catalan numbers, uh, which uh, we know. Moreover, uh, we prove the following result. The summering ket n is closed under all derivations where m uh, is 1 to n minus 2. All this makes it possible to do a complete description of the new potent endomorphisms of ECN. We prove the following assertion. The same rings of the new potent endomorphisms N, uh, N and the same ring cat N minus one are isomorphic. The same ring N, N is closed under arbitrary derivation uh, which uh, order n minus one or uh, order n minus two for um, m from one to n minus three. Now we will talk again about roots of idempotent endomorphisms. We construct the same ring CLM uh, from sigma n, which is a right ideal of sigma n and also dm, which is a sub summering of uh, this uh, sigma n. Also, we construct a map dlm, uh, and uh, the following results was obtained uh, for any integer s and, and m, where uh, there are uh, greater than one and uh, uh, less or equal n minus one. And uh, L is uh, less than or equal m. The projection DLM is a derivation. The semi-ring DM is the maximal sub ring of CN, such that the map DLM is a derivation for a fixed endomorphism alpha zero. Uh, the set of endomorphisms alpha such that DLM alpha uh, equal to alpha zero is denoted by uh, the sign of in integral alpha nul DLM. Uh, an interesting result is that this integral is a sub ring of sigma n if and only if alpha zero is an uh, in idempotent endomorphism. At the end of this article, using a result, result uh, from the previous, we prove uh, that the number of the same ring of the form integral alpha zero d one m, where uh, uh, alpha zero belongs to c one m, is equal to f two m, which it it is a uh, two-amped Fibonacci number. Matrices and Catalan numbers. In 2023, my paper uh, deals with new class of additively idempotent semering. We begin with the following definitions. Let S and S nulla be additively identical semering with a zero and an identity. Let S be uh, let S be a non-commutative semering and an S zero semi-module. Uh, S nulla be a commutative semering and alpha S is equal S alpha for any alpha. Uh, belongs to S0 and S belongs to S. Then S is called an S0 semi-algebra. Uh, 
let s be an s0 semi-algebra and uh, beta s is equal uh, e i j be a finite basis of s with the properties. And it is a definition. Um, I, uh, e i j uh, multiply e k l is equal to e i l if j is less or equal k and zero in another cases. The sum e from one to n from a e e is equal to um, identity of s and uh, a e i j is great uh, than e i k for all k great than j and a i e i j is great than e h j for all h less than i this basis is called an e basis Note, note that the basis elements A, E, E are idempotents. And since, uh, since uh, this equality, if I is uh, less than J, they do not commute. Since uh, E, I, J uh, multiplied to E, I, J is equal to E, I, J, when I is greater than J, it follows that the basis elements under the main diagonal uh, also, uh, are, also are idempotents. Similarly, from this fact that uh, it's zero, when i is uh, less than j, it follows that the basis elements over the main diagonal are nilpotent elements. There are many examples of semi algebras with E basis, but we present only one related to the previous part of this talk. Let us consider a finite chain C4, uh, so uh, E C4 zero consists of all endomorphisms having zero as a fixed point. Recall that any endomorphisms uh, alpha has a form uh, zero, E0, 1, E1, 2, E2, and 3, E3, where um, the sum of uh, indices is equal to 4. For any k, 1, 2, 3, the strings uh, 4 from 1 to k are subsemerings of E, C, C, C4, consisting of the following endomorphisms. Uh, 0, 4, 0, 3, K1, uh, 0, 2, K2, and uh, 0, K3. Uh, these non-zero endomorphisms for uh, this K form an additive basis of the semi-ring uh, E, C, 4. Thus, we construct a matrix such that it's uh, 4 minus K, consists of non-zero endomorphisms from the string uh, where k1 uh, k is equal to 1, 2, or 3. The first my result of the paper is let s be an s0 semi-algebra and uh, beta s is uh, equal to e i j uh, is an e basis of S, then S is isomorphic to a matrix subsemering of Mn S0. Now let S be an S0 semi-algebra and be S an E basis of S and assume that the basis is triangular. Uh, an important example of semi-ring with a triangular E basis is cat n. Uh, we prove that beta cat n is equal to this matrix where uh, zero uh, is a zero of cat. 
from the proof of the last theorem and the form of E basis, we obtain two consequence related to Catalan numbers. The number of upper triangular matrices, uh, 01, of order N, under the standard operations of matrices over Boolean semiring, which are sums of the matrices A, I, J, such that A, I, J is a 0, 1 matrix con containing in its upper right hand corner a sub matrix of type E uh, multiply uh, E times uh, N plus 1 minus J with entry entries equal to 1 and all other, other elements of A, I, J are zeros is equal to the n plus one Catalan numbers. And uh, for n equal three, uh, these matrices are this. The first six matrices is the basic and uh, another is the sums of this six. Uh, if we uh, add zero matrix, uh, they are uh, just uh, 14, uh, which is the uh, four Catalan numbers. Uh, the second uh, example uh, is the, uh, when the number of upper triangular uh, matrices of order N with the following property. If uh, A i j is equal to one, then all entries, uh, entries of the sub matrix of type uh, i times j in the upper right hand corner of A are zeros, is equal to n plus one Catalan number. And uh, it is uh, all 14 matrices. Uh, note that the intersection of considered two sets of matrices from last two examples uh, has only one matrix, uh, it is zero matrix. Mm. They're uh, not mirror uh, uh, and not receive one from another. Um. It is important to note that overall the results related to Catalan numbers are not fundamental to each of the articles. This result creates the appearance of new research. Thank you for attention. Thank you, Dimitrinka. Are there comments, questions? Uh, well, uh, if, if there are none, let's thank Dimitrinka once again. This concludes the official meeting. I will now stop recording. Uh, next week, there will be a talk by uh, your copies. Uh, it will be at one o'clock again, uh, and that it will be a hybrid meeting.